Yo, what's up, what's up, my friends? So smart, back to you, screen right about now. Super pumped, super excited as always. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, do well to click that red subscribe button down below. It will do you so much good. If you click on that red subscribe button down below, smash the like button for the YouTube algorithm. All right, so let's dive into this video. All right, so we've got the trader, we've got the market makers. All right, so let's see what this has for. So I'm reacting to this video, you know, seeing traders blowing their account size. Mind you, at the end and power on the middle part of this video, I'm going to tell you something that is very, very important. The true, the three rules in trading, I call this the three rules in trade. Don't ever forget it. Anytime you place in a trade by yourself, whatever market you're in, don't ever forget this rule. So if you, if one of these rules is not in place, definitely you're not going to be profitable in the market. Take it from me anytime and day. So of course, series of losses, hundred loss on this account. So imagine you losing this this money just on a single trade. That's quite a lot, you know. I know most of them they don't obey risk management, which as a trader you don't need to ignore if you want to stay profitable in the long run. Don't ever ignore risk management because on the long run it will be so so devastating that you ignore it. So you can see a loss of two hundred and thirty eight thousand dollars. That's quite a lot for just a single trade. Not being risk management will end up damaging your trading account. Take it from me any time of the day. So, not to be risk management. So you can see series of losses right there. That's a loss, you know. On just a single trade. Don't ever trade like this. Don't ever do it. So you can see the lot size and, and the trading account. You know, I know most of the people watching this video they are forex traders. So you can see the account size and the risks that this person is taking. It's quite a lot. I know that if it goes in your favor, you, you're going to make a lot of money. But, you know, using this big account size and not obeying risk management, that's really not trading. That's gambling, pure gambling. Take it from me any time of the day. You know, you have a social large account size and you're not obeying risk management. Bro, you're gambling. That's just the sole fact of it, you know. Because if you have a good account size, you know, you should be able to obey risk management and trade that account size reasonably. That's what you should do. Everything, that's what every trader should do. If you have a little account like $200 or $300, you can flip it, you know, but I don't advise that. Don't have a flip account. But if you want to do that, you can do it with liberal account size, not a big account size that you're using to trade. So you can see the risk there and the trading account right about there. So it's quite a lot, you know. Don't ever trade this way. Say it's a NASDAQ. It's trading NASDAQ and it's taking, you know, such a high risk. There is a high risk trade, you know. High risk trade, high winning. So that's exactly what he's trying to do. So high risk, high winning. <laughs> that's quite a lot, you know, bro. But if it goes against you, that's uh, that's emotional roller coaster. As usual, you the GBP USD 15 minutes time frame. I don't know why he's buying this market. I feel, I feel that. All right. He's thinking that the stuff is going to form the double bottom. This is 15. Mind you, I'm, I'm a swing trader, so I, I can't really let it sit, you know, the, the, the trend of the market. But I feel, oh my word, this is, this is looking like a sell. But, you know, this is Forex, you know, it's buying or selling. So as one is buying, another person is selling. That's Forex trading for you. So what I'm seeing might be different from what you're saying that's why you know that's that's a forest market you know what i'm saying so i can't really say that's a forex market so if you have trade conferences or more you can de definitely buy or sell maybe trend line you know your support and resistance or maybe fibonacci you know shot pattern whatever part are you using to trade you know three three and above don't make it so so complicated two three and above then you know you're good to go three that's very very good if you have three confluences and showing that you should buy or you sell the market definitely you're good to go don't allow anybody deceive you in the forest market you know if you have good three confluences let me see for instance i've got support and resistance you've got the trend line i've got a very reasonable shot pattern just sell or buy the market you know sir so this is our account size you know so you can see that it's 0 0.7 weeks 0.7 lot size for this account. It's not even up to $200.
definitely don't trade this way. So the three stuffs I talked about, the three rules that you should not forget why trading any any trade, you know, any trade, synthetic indices, currency market, you know, you're a stock trader, you are a cryptocurrency trader, don't ever forget these three things. Your risk management, don't ever forget that. Your trading psychology, don't ever forget that. And your strategy, very, very important. And to top it all, your risk management, you know, your emotion. Your emotion, you have to be emotional strong. You, know, you don't have to be emotional about a market, you know. If you lose money, everybody tends to be emotion, emotion, like get emotion about it. But you don't have to be, you know, get a to be shot, be emotion about your trading and, you know, whatnot. Don't ever be emotional about about trading, you know. But I know if you lose money, definitely, you know, emotions are going to set in. But, you know, just just keep it low. So, you know, no obey risk management. All these videos I'm going to show, most of them is because they, you know, all of them, I would say all of them, they are not obey risk management. That's why they end up blowing their accounts. Um, if you're not obeying risk management, most certainly your trading psychology is not in check. That's just the truth, you know. That's just the truth. So we've got a blown account. We've got a blown account. All oh, it's devastating, you know. It's it's wow. So you can see the risks that the person took. 0.70. So I imagine now for this little account size, don't ever trade this way. I always tell people not to trade this way because no being risk management end up you know damaging your account. So of course series of losses right there. Series of losses. Series of losses. It's it's it's, it's very very painful, you know. So you can see 0.50, 0.50 for this account size. You might end up blowing your account. Definitely take it from me. You end up my god. What's this? this? This is news actually. This is actually news. Oh, he's done. No, like seriously, he's done. Look at it. He's done like he's done. Count is blown. My, oh, right. Look at it. You know, trading in the news. Ah, my words. I'm not really advised. If you don't know what you're doing, stay house of the news. Don't trade the news if you don't know what you're doing. And most of the time, volatility tends to set in and the, the spread tends to be very very high so you can look at it from the shot spread is very very high and and you know if it doesn't go in your favor before you see and if you have a little account size before you see your account get blown you know that's 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 trading in my life. It's, it's something else something else now all right let's let's see what this has for us and all right so Ah, my world. I, 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 I don't know. Barrix, you see, it's off, bro. It's out of the game. That's how it is. Oh, look at this. Oh, my world. Look, so look at the spread. Look at the spread I'm talking about. Most of the most of you know, news event that's that's what both brokers do. You know, it's not something that is new in the market. You know, that's what brokers do. There tends to be a lot of volatility in the market, you know, and the spread will be so, so high. Okay. Oh, GBP, NZD, and oil. I remember when oil did, you know, something bad to me. I was using a very, very, not, not that I was not big risk management, but I ended up losing at a loss about $2 something, but it's just a little account, you know. Oil can be devastating. Trading oil with a little account size can be so, so devastating. It's quite a lot. So he's buying this market and it's, it's kind of like, it's, it's edging, bro. This is buying and selling, you know, GBP, MZD. So it's edging the market. Maybe the loss was too much for him. And look at the account size right about there. That's a lot, you know. Look at the account size and you end up blowing your account. That's uh, just about $5 right there. And, oh, my world, like, emotion setting and you, you just blew your account. Uh, no, all this is because you're not using a proper risk manager. Mind you, if you're enjoying the video, click that like button, very, very subscribe button, very, very important. Like this video, you know, it will not take anything away from you. Just like the video, you know, and, and share the video, you know, to all Forex traders. I know 
everybody that is watching this is uh, definitely a forex trader so volatility can be crazy sometimes you can see you know trading volatility with such a kind size is not is not bro you can't you can't go anywhere bro. all star so this is synthetic in this right there and synthetic is quite volatile you know don't ever trade <laughs> Volatility D75. You can trade it, you know, but you know, volatility D75 have, have, you know, send a lot of people packing, you know what I'm saying, right? <laughs> volatility D75 is, 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 is an emotional roller coaster on its own, you know. Ah, my word, what are you doing, bro? You're, you, you're buying gold with this account size. What, what do you expect to like gain from this? Like, you definitely go to blow your account. It's not even up to two dollars, and you're trading gold, bro. Ah. Uh, Alright, so this is the end of this video. If you like this video, please give this video a very, very big like. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. And, and definitely going to see you on the next one. Peace out for now.